It's Tina Whalen here with another top story today. The Washington Post has posted a article in today's news. Wait until you see, and I'm going to read some of the articles article to you, and it's just, this is disgusting. This is just downright disgusting. This should never happen. Why is he working for the Pentagon and our Defense Department? You ready for this one? You might get a good laugh because I laughed at first until I found out where this guy worked. And then I didn't think it was funny anymore. So, sit back and let me read. Let me put my glasses on. A warning left on a nanny's car license plate stolen and a top Pentagon official in big trouble. Folks, what, is, what the heck is going on? Okay. The mystery that for weeks unnerved this quiet Capitol Hill neighborhood began with a warning place on a nanny's windshield. I know you are misusing this visitor pass to park here daily, the April 4th note read. If you do not stop, I will report it. Have your car towed, and the residents who provided this to you will have his privileges taken away. Baffled the young couple, the nanny workforce sent out a message to their community through email group asking for the notes anonymous author to contact them no one came forward instead two days later the nanny's license plate was stolen from her suv according to charging documents two days after that another plate was stolen then in late april the thief strikes once more but this time the couple caught him on a video camera that they had mounted inside their home front window now and the alleged culprit in and only in washington story police identify him as brian whitman a top pentagon official who has worked for our defense department for more than two decades we're laughing stock of america here folks what the heck we're hiring people and they're stealing license plates really smart after heading over the police the plates to the police and being charged with three counts of misdemeanor theft whitman 58 agreed to deal on tuesday that would lead to the case dismissal if he pays a thousand dollars in restoration performs 32 hours of community service remains out of trouble for the next 10 months and stays away from both the nanny and women for whom she works. So he's getting a slap on the wrist. Because he works for our Pentagon and the Defense Department? What do you think, folks? What do you think should happen to Whitman? Let me know. Comment below. I will share this link to this to this article in the description below. Let's have a little talk about this. This is ridiculous. This is a disgrace to the United States that this man here is still working for our Defense Department when he stole license plates. <coughs> I don't I don't get it. I don't get it at all. So let's talk about this, folks. <laughs> 